Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today we're going to be continuing in the uh, quest to create Batman villains. So today I'm going to work a little bit on Killer Croc. <clears throat> he hasn't really been one of my favorite characters um, in the Batman villain universe. Just because, um, you know, I don't follow the comic book per se story, so I don't know the intricacies involved in this particular character. I'm more of a Joker, Penguin, um... Riddler kind of guy. But on the other hand, I do like the fact that they expanded the universe uh, of villains. So we're going to go ahead and do the pencils and simple inks for, um, for Killer Croc, and I hope you enjoy. So I'm going to do some um, sketching and talking, and we'll go from there. So it is the wonderful season coming up of Christmas. And um, before that, of course, we have Thanksgiving. Um, I've been really blessed, uh, recently to have quite a bit of work on my plate, which is awesome. You know, I get a lot of questions in my feed in reference to, um, how somebody gets jobs, um, to become a freelancer. <clears throat> Excuse me. Got a little bit of a congested chest cold today. <clears throat> and my response is it varies obviously with the question because I don't want to give a blanket question like you just got to work harder <laughs> no that's not the way it works a lot of times whenever you do freelance work you get work by something called referral and referral happens by word of mouth the best advertising and the best um, way that I have found that I get work is by somebody either seeing my work online or I've done a previous job for somebody and since I did a good job for them, they refer me. I have always had that ability to kind of hop from one job to another or I'm doing a job and then two other fires or three other fires kind of um, get stoked to where I can go and do those jobs. So, that being said, there's always the internet, there's always advertising, there's always paid advertising through through um, Facebook, but what I have found, which has been the most successful thing for me, has been word of mouth. And um, believe it or not, a lot of people look at the website LinkedIn and they don't know how to use it. Um, LinkedIn is an extremely powerful tool because of the way that their um, their friend system works not only friends but also um, colleagues you know their colleague system like uh, their like system so it's like you set an account up and then you go out and based on the keywords that you put in for your particular um, job and skill set it'll pull up uh, relevant other keywords from other people and artists so whenever I first had my LinkedIn profile I looked for companies like Disney, I looked for companies like Pixar, I looked for company, you know, some of those companies, and then I started plugging in um, toy companies. So whenever you do that and they accept your friendship, then that opens the door up to all of the other friends that they might have that you can basically ask um, you know, their friendship. And it, and it just kind of keeps going to the point where Eventually, if you get a lot of connections, then you get access to the industry professionals that you're looking for. And if you post um, artwork all the time, it goes on their feed. So whenever it goes on their feed, then basically they see what you do. <laughs> and whenever they see what you do, then, uh, you know, if they see what you do every day or see, you know, some of the cool projects that you have, then they will keep you in mind for future employment opportunities and or freelance. I've received a lot of freelance work from my um, from my association or relationship inside of LinkedIn. And that is fantastic. Um, it's a free service if you you utilize the free service that they have. Of course there's paid. But I have had great success using LinkedIn. I've also had good success using uh, a website company, um, hosting company that's free called Coraflow. And Coraflow, okay, so I've, so we're at five minutes here. So Coraflow is basically a 
portfolio hosting place that you do for free and they have job postings and I've, I've received quite a few different um, jobs from there too. So LinkedIn and Coreflow, check those out. Coreflow, C-O-R-O-F-L-O-T and of course LinkedIn, you just go ahead and Google that and you'll pull up a myriad of profiles and, and be sure to put stuff in the, your LinkedIn profile which is relevant to what you want to do. Um, you know, and then uh, make sure you do your keywords and, and they have tutorials inside of there on how to basically utilize your core flow, or not core flow, utilize your uh, LinkedIn profile to its maximum. I highly recommend it. Um, and of course, always do good work, finish your jobs, and uh, you know, do something every day. So anyway, today is Killer Croc. I'm gonna go ahead and switch this over to time lapse um, and uh, you guys can enjoy and thank you guys for you know visiting, uh, liking, and subscribing um, to my channel. Um, I'm trying to get videos posted every week. If that doesn't happen, my uh, sincere apologies. Is you know sometimes whenever you're doing work and you have deadlines and stuff, it just it's a little taxing whenever you have to do a lot of videos <laughs> per se. But I will do my best to keep up with it and keep you guys in the loop on exactly what's going on um, on my neck in my neck of the woods. So thank you guys once again, and we'll see you on the other side.